I mean, freedom is one of my uh, most intouchable rights, I think, which is the most uh, important for me, because it means that I can, on one hand, be who I am and like I am, but it also gives other people the possibility to act and react and just live like they want. Actually, freedom in Tunisia, in comparison uh, with, uh, with it before the revolution, we have it, we have it a little bit, but not enough, not the freedom that we've uh, dreamed uh, after the revolution and during the revolution. Because uh, we hear uh, yet and uh, still about uh, uh, arresting of journalists, uh, arresting of uh, stars and singers of rap, of, uh, and uh, then we have two journalists in Libya that we, know, we don't know about them, either they are uh, alive or they are dead. Uh, actually, in Poland, uh, our freedom is quite uh, well. <laughs> the condition of freedom is quite well. We can actually do whatever we want till it's not uh, connected to uh, the freedom of another people. Uh, but I guess together with the changing of uh, our government a couple of months ago, it's changing a bit. Uh, because they are trying to change the constitution and so on and so on. So let's hope that it will stay like it is now, because right now it's very good. In Hungary, actually, we feel that we are free, as uh, we can move, we can come from one place to the other, and right now we can leave the country. However, during the socialist times, we were not allowed to leave the country without permission, and it was really hard to get, for example, a passport. Right now, this mobility is free, because we are part of the European Union. We don't even need sometimes papers to cross the border. But I believe that right now the barriers are many, much time in the minds of people. So it's in the head of people and they are sometimes controlled in a way, especially because the new government is telling to people that uh, it's really dangerous to mix with other countries. It's uh, really dangerous that we are letting in people. And I think if we are not open to other people, that also means we are closing ourselves into a cage. Freedom in Egypt now totally changed from the past. Uh, I could tell you in the past, you, could, you if you're sitting in a cafe with a couple of friends, it's, uh, it's impossible to talk about politics. Uh, because if you did, a police would catch you and uh, like imprison you. But now it's, it's, it's completely fine to talk about freedom whenever and wherever you want to, uh, because the police would fear to do that to you. But uh, now we, we took freedom to the extent that it's not safe anymore because everybody thinks that they can do whatever they want whenever they want to. So in, uh, in the sense of freedom, in terms of security, it's, it's a bit unstable.